When upon life's billows you are tempest-tossed, when you are discouraged thinking all is lost, count your many blessings, name them one by one, and it will surprise you what the Lord hath done. Count your blessings, name them one by one. Count your blessings, see what God hath done. Count your blessings, name them one by one. Count your many blessings, see what God hath done. Are you ever burdened with a load of care? Does the cross seem heavy you are called to bear? Count your many blessings, every doubt will fly, and you will be singing as the days go by. Count your blessings, name them one by one. Count your blessings, see what God hath done. Count your blessings, Name them one by one. Count your many blessings, see what God hath done. So amid the conflict, whether great or small, do not be discouraged, God is over all. Count your many blessings, angels will attend. Help and comfort give you to your journey's end. Count your blessings, name them one by one. Count your blessings, see what God hath done. Count your blessings, name them one by one. Count your many blessings, see what God hath done. Good morning. It is a little rainy out there today. Um, <clears throat> so we're inside again. We are continuing our journey through the scriptures. We're in the Psalms now. And uh, we're picking up with Psalm 61. O oh God, listen to my cry. Hear my prayer. From the ends of the earth, I will cry to you for help. For my heart is overwhelmed. Lead me to the towering rock of safety, for you are my safe refuge, a fortress where my enemies cannot reach me. Let me live forever in your sanctuary, safe beneath the shelter of your wings. For you have heard my vows, O God. You have given me an inheritance reserved for those who fear your name. Add many years to the life of the king. May his years span the generations. May he reign under God's protection forever. Appoint your unfailing love and faithfulness to watch over him. Then I will always sing praises to your name as I fulfill my vows day after day. Psalm 62 I wait quietly before God, for my salvation comes from him. He alone is my rock and my salvation, my fortress where I will never be shaken. So many enemies against one man, all of them trying to kill me. To them I'm just a broken down wall or a tottering fence. They plan to topple me from my high position. They delight in telling lies about me. They are friendly to my face, but they curse me in their hearts. I wait quietly before God, for my hope is in Him. He alone is my rock and my salvation, my fortress where I will not be shaken. My salvation and my honor come from God alone. He is my refuge, a rock where no enemy can reach me. O oh, my people, trust in him at all times. Pour out your heart to him, for God is our refuge. From the greatest to the lowliest, all are nothing in his sight. If you weigh them on the scales, they are lighter than a puff of air. Don't try to get rich by extortion or robbery. And if your wealth increases, don't make it the center of your life. God has spoken plainly, and I have heard it many times. Power, O God, belongs to you. Unfailing love, O Lord, is yours. Surely you judge all the people according to what they have done. Psalm 64 O God, listen to my complaint. 
Do not let my enemies' threats overwhelm me. Protect me from the plots of the wicked, from the scheming of those who do evil. Sharp tongues are the swords they wield. Bitter words are the arrows they aim. They shoot from ambush at the innocent, attacking suddenly and fearlessly. They encourage each other to do evil and plan how to set their traps. Who will ever notice, they ask. As they plot their crimes, they say, We have devised the perfect plan. Yes, the human heart and mind are cunning. But God himself will shoot them down. Suddenly his arrows will pierce them. Their own words will be turned against them, destroying them. All who see it happening will shake their heads in scorn. Then everyone will stand in awe, proclaiming the mighty acts of God, realizing all the amazing things he does. The godly will rejoice in the Lord and find shelter in him, and those who do what is right will praise him. Psalm 65 What mighty praise, O God, belongs to you in Zion! We fulfill our vows to you, for you answer our prayers, and to you all people will come. Though our hearts are filled with sins, you forgive them all. What joy for those you choose to bring near, those who live in your holy courts. What joy awaits us inside your holy temple. You faithfully answer our prayers with awesome deeds. O God, our Savior, you are the hope of everyone on earth even those who sail on distant seas. You formed the mountains by your power and armed yourself with mighty strength. You quieted the raging oceans with their pounding waves and silenced the shouting of the nations. Those who live at the ends of the earth stand in awe of your wonders. From where the sun rises to where it sets, you inspire shouts of joy. You take care of the earth and water it, making it rich and fertile. The rivers of God will not run dry. They provide a bountiful harvest of grain, for you have ordered it so. You drench the plowed ground with rain, melting the clods and leveling the ridges. You soften the earth with showers and bless its abundant crops. You crown the year with a bountiful harvest. Even the hard pathways overflow with abundance. The wilderness becomes a lush pasture and the hillside blooms with joy. The meadows are clothed with flocks of sheep, and the valleys are carpeted with grain. They all shout and sing for joy. Psalm 66 Shout joyful praises to God, all the earth. Sing about the glory of his name. Tell the world how glorious he is. Say to God, how awesome are your deeds. Your enemies cringe before your mighty power. Everything on earth will worship you. They will sing your praises, shouting your name in glorious songs. Come and see what our God has done, what awesome miracles he does for his people. He made a dry path through the Red Sea, and his people went across on foot. Come, let us rejoice in who he is, for by his great power he rules forever. He watches every movement of the nations. Let no rebel rise in defiance. Let the whole world bless our God and sing aloud his praises. Our lives are in his hands and he keeps our feet from stumbling. You have tested us, O God. You have purified us like silver melted in a crucible. You captured us in your net and laid the burden of slavery on our backs. You sent troops to ride across our broken bodies. We went through fire and flood but you brought us to a place of great abundance. Now I come to your temple with burnt offerings to fulfill the vows I made to you. Yes, the sacred vows you heard me make when I was in deep trouble. That is why I'm sacrificing burnt offerings to you, the best of my rams as a pleasing aroma, and I will sacrifice bulls and goats. Come and listen, all you who fear God, and I will tell you what he did for me. For I cried out to him for help, praising him as I spoke. If I had not confessed the sin in my heart, my Lord would not have listened. But God did listen. He paid attention to my prayer. Praise God who did not ignore my prayer and did not withdraw his unfailing love from me. Psalm 67 May God be merciful and bless us. 
May his face shine with favor upon us. May your ways be known throughout the earth, your saving power among people everywhere. May the nations praise you, O God. Yes, may all the nations praise you. How glad the nations will be singing for joy because you govern them with justice and direct the actions of the whole world. May the nations praise you, O God. Yes, may all the nations praise you. Then the earth will yield its harvest, and God, our God, will richly bless us. Yes, God will bless us, and people all over the world will fear him. The word of God for the people of God. Thanks be to God. So our closing song this morning is There Stands a Rock. So you can take a deep breath and sing along with me. There stands a rock on shores of time That rears to heaven its head sublime That rock is clapped and they are blessed Who find within this cleft a rest Some build their hopes on the ever-drifting sand Some on their fame or the treasure or their land Minds on the rock that forever shall stand, Jesus, the rock of ages. That rocks across its arms outspread, celestial glory bears its head to its firm base by all I bring, and to the cross of ages cling. Some build their hopes on the ever-drifting sand, Some on their fame, or their treasure, or their land. Mine's on the rock that forever shall stand, Jesus, the rock of ages. That rock's a tower whose lofty high Illumined with heaven's clouded light, Hopes wide its gates beneath the dome Where saints find rest with Christ at home Some build their hopes on the ever-drifting sand Some on their fame or the treasure or their land Mines on the rock that forever shall stand Jesus the rock of ages Yes. Good morning, Rhonda. Good morning, Mary Nell. Good morning, Jim and Peggy. Good morning, Patty. Good morning, Shirley. Hope everybody enjoys this beautiful day, and I'll see y'all back tomorrow morning at 8. <laughs>